I'd just like to talk to you a tiny bit about why you might like to work for a charity in the first place. I must admit that I didn't really think of a charity career when I was going through university. There were very few charitable organisations that came to our university. Uh, there were very few organisations that tried to get you to sign up to their uh, graduate intake schemes. And of course, many charities don't even have anything like a graduate intake scheme. Um, but along with a lot of people who I was with at university, we, we knew that we wanted to do something that had some sort of social value. And actually, if charities had come along and talked to us, I think a few of us might have been interested and a number of my friends have gone on to work in the sector um, since leaving university. So I think a charity career can be a really interesting career. Charities now are professionally run organisations. Of course, charities like any sector can be uh, very varied, very different to each other. Um, many charities are, are, are tiny and so lack some of the resources that bigger organisations might. Um, so you have to think about that when perhaps you're thinking about how you'd like to develop your career. I started off in a small charity and I found it interesting because it gave me the opportunity to build up my experience across a, a variety of different roles and to really sort of earn my stripes a little bit before I started to engage with the charity sector more widely. But I think that a charity sector career can be a really fulfilling thing. And many, many people that I talk to in the sector certainly feel that. One of the things that people really like to be able to do, of course, is to make a, a positive impact on the lives of the beneficiaries or the cause which the charity is focusing on. And of course, that's incredibly important. It's why charities were set up in the first place. You need to think carefully about if you're going to have a job that takes you away from a beneficiary. So if you have a, a back office role, for example, your work will very much um, be useful for furthering the course of that charity. It'll be absolutely essential. However, you might not be the person who's actually directly delivering um, those services to the people that your charity is there to support. Um, if that's the case and you want to be one of those people, you have to think very carefully about that. It may be, however, that you prefer a back office role and you know that your skills would really be able to help people in that way. And that's fantastic too. But in either way, I think you really need to think about that. The great thing about charities for me is quite often they're at the forefront of, um, of sort of social progress. Um, so if you're involved or if you want to be involved in social progress, um, if you think the world needs to change in various ways, charities can be a fantastic vehicle in order to do that. It doesn't mean that charities can solve everything and they certainly have to work in partnership with other sectors, but charities can be a fantastic part of the puzzle. Working for a charity is a very overlooked career, I feel, and it's one that I'm certainly very passionate about getting more people to think about. So hopefully that's piqued your interest a little bit. Hopefully it's a career that you'd like to look into, and I wish you the very best of luck if that's something you'd like to consider.